So I thought I'd show you this time the project I'm working on. This is a ferry boat. Um, I don't have many details of what it's made out of. Uh, some type of wood, but all the inside has been stripped out, repainted. So it's went all back to wood, repainted. The front has been sprayed in a white. Um, so that this literally used to have a wheelhouse on it and then we ripped it all out so we're literally rebuilding the entire boat again but it's got around six to ten layers of paint on it because it all varies on each side of the boat so it comes back to something like this and it's all sanded all back um, but it's it's taken a very long time to do this boat because I'm doing it by myself so it's getting there um, and this is what my project is um, I have another one of these on the way in well as soon as this one's done there's going to be another one a lot bigger uh, I think it's about five foot bigger barrier boat the bigger version of what this one was but this is one side if I can make my way down is the other um, this is just primer but you get a like, couple little people dinking it and then it means I have to redo it again but what I do is show you what it's like now and then make a video of what it looks like after I'm finished but there you get a couple of faults in it someone dinks it or you get bubbles in it because the water has to be uh, the wood has to be moist but if it's too wet inside it'll start bubbling but if it's too dry then it'll start cracking so you've got to time it all right when you literally paint it you've got to time it just about right but you can see the thickness of that and that's what i'm having to take all back to wood sometimes it's not even fully back to wood um, it's usually like this because the wood uh, pushes in and then it, uh, obviously you get the swelling and it comes out so you've got multiple things you got to look out for in these type of boats and it's just taking a long time because the wood was very moist inside and when I took this back it's such a thick layer of paint it's been holding so much back inside so you don't get bubbles obviously you get effects like that where they just peel off um, and that wasn't me doing that one that's previous and then you've got little scrapes going down it from where the paint is obviously heated up and it's scraped across but everything's a work in progress at the moment we've got this that needs cleaning up we're going to put a brand new sleeve underneath this and obviously it all needs cleaning up it's all just icky um, but the inside isn't too bad we've got an engine for this as well uh, I'm not sure what it is yet but it's all a work in progress it's getting there so this is my project that I've been doing for probably a couple of weeks now because um, I'm having to do it solo and all of these need rebuilding at the top the side we're tempted to because of all of this uh, it's just been dinked and hit way too much um, but the wood's in good shape for the year of the boat um, you've got stuff like this that just pops out but that's about it it's all just a work in progress at the moment so once this is all done I'll probably post a video of the finish on this boat um, I've done hundreds of boats so I do know what I'm doing with, with the boat side um, but it's all just a work in progress but stay safe I'm going to leave it as that and like and follow Cheers.